Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This law of attraction technique works so fast. It incorporates one of the major things I've taught on this channel and that is to be in your own energy. If you want to manifest love, money, a social life, whatever it is, if you are able to hone in on your own energy rather than pushing your energy out into others or external circumstances, then you will speed up that manifestation in getting to you in the fastest way possible. In fact, this can literally work within a day, within an hour, depends how well you do it and how well you consistently stick to it. And the technique I'm gonna show you guys, you may have heard before, and it's called the frame technique. Now the frame technique is where you realize that you are in your own frame, your own energy, and everything else is separate to you. When you have this non-needy, non-desperate energy, and it's focused from within, that's when you manifest what you want in the external. So have you noticed when you want to manifest love and you're being really needy and you're telling the other person, I want you to be the perfect person and I want you to call me all the time and I want you to do this, and then you realize that person goes to you or something. Well, that's because you put your energy into them rather than in yourself, in your own passions, in your own happiness, in the things that make you alive. When you put the energy into yourself, that's when you are the most magnetic, authentic version of yourself. So when you do this, you will attract that person or that job or that money or whatever it is if you simply put the energy back into yourself. You see, we're so used to focusing on all our problems and all the different things that life throws at us. So we're so consumed by all of that that we forget that manifestation is actually an inner journey. It's to do with your own energy. I mean, if you think about the entire force and teaching behind the law of attraction, it is basically that we vibrate energy and then similar energy matches that energy of ours. Now you see, if we vibrate an energy of lack or lack of abundance or desperation or discomfort about being single perhaps, that's when we're putting out an energy of lack into the universe. But if you stop focusing on all those things around you that you don't have and you go back inward and you realize that you have the energy from within, that's when one, you'll be motivated to manifest and two, you will stop stressing about you not having the manifestation and actually start doing what will get you the manifestation, which is to bring it all back inwards. Now, the frame technique can be complemented with the flame meditation. Sounds similar, frame, flame, but no, I mean a candle flame. So all you need to do is simply light a candle and stare at it. And notice between that candle flame the separation between you and that candle flame. You stare at the flame, so let's pretend my finger is the flame, and you stare at it and you notice that you are separate from that object. You are separate from all your external circumstances. When you do that and you recognize the separation between you and the candle flame and you stare at it, you are bringing the energy back into yourself. You're noticing that this is an object an object we give meaning to. And the same applies to the rest in your life. Perhaps when you're walking to work in the morning, notice the separation between you and other people and focus on your own self and your own walk to work. And when you do that, that's when external circumstances will resonate with that high vibe energy because you have truly brought the energy back into yourself you realized the separation between you and external circumstances and the meaning that you give those external circumstances. And then you can rewire your thinking by being the person who has already manifested what you want to manifest. So the frame technique works, being in your own frame. If you complement this with the flame meditation where you simply stare at a candle flame and you see the separation between you and the flame, then you can start detaching to these external circumstances and realize that the external circumstances and the objects around you that is not you is simply all a cultivation of the meaning you give it. So if your relationship with that flame is neutral, 
you should try to see your relationship with the things you want in life as neutral. That it doesn't matter if they're there or not, you are complete anyway. And the irony is when you do this, the thing you want comes to you. And that's when you manifest exactly what you want in the fastest way possible. Now remember, manifestation requires discipline. It requires strong mental effort. Do not stray away from your own energy and bringing it back into your body. You can't just do this once. You've got to consistently do it over a period of time until that object no longer bothers you. And then you realize that that object is only away from you or not happened or manifested for you because of the meaning and the story and your belief system about it. But you can't rewire this entire belief system when you are so negatively charged towards that person, object, circumstance. Which is why the flame technique can help you detach, notice the separation between you and the object, so in this case the flame, and then you can rewire your brain and build a new relationship with your external circumstances. In a way, this helps you rewrite the thoughts and the belief system that you've painted out for these manifestations that you want to take place. If you start owning your own energy, you can detach from external circumstances, realize that you want to give a new meaning to those circumstances or objects or people, and then you can start rewiring in that new belief system, which will then help you manifest exactly what you want in the fastest way possible. Just simply relax. Stop waiting for that manifestation to keep coming because you're exuding lack. Just focus on your own energy, clearing that out using the flame technique and through other manifestation techniques. Build better mental clarity so that you have the strength to consistently adopt these behaviors and then your manifestation will definitely come. It is the law. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. To support my channel, please hit that like button and that subscribe button and that bell notification so that you get informed on when I release a video as a lot of the information is time sensitive. And also guys, comment down below. I would love to hear from you and hear how this video helped you or what has helped you manifest what you want. Anyway guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye.